many of you have a work area that's covered with positive affirmations, tips on post-its, and maybe the latest sports recipe? Well, here's an alternative to that. These inspirational quotes are covered in resin and encapsulated in a ready-to-hang picture frame. And here's how you make them. Hey, Mom! These are the supplies that you're gonna need. I purchased two different packages of stickers. These were happy, positive message stickers I got from Dollar Tree. These frames came from a thrift store, but they were really cheap. And the sticker says that they're actually from Walmart. Just make sure you get something cheap because you're gonna to wanna to customize it. So the first thing I did, which is wrong, is I glued, I high glued the backs of the picture frames because I wanted to make sure that the present would escape. In retrospect, I probably should have painted it first. I could have painted it behind the glass or I could have like put maybe some scrapbooking paper back there and it would have turned out a lot better. But hey, you craft, you learn. I think I was just really focused on sealing it so that the resin wouldn't seep through. Here's where I'm turning them over and I'm realizing that I didn't even take the old timesy pictures out. Oh well, moving on. So what I decided to do is first take whatever kind of affirmations or stickers or fortune cookie messages or whatever you're going to put in them and make sure that they fit. I did have to trim the stickers a little bit to make sure that they fit perfectly in place. The frames. Then the fun part. It's time to decorate. So I wound up painting them and I decided to just go kind of rustic with acrylic. Um, I wasn't worried about coverage or anything like that. Um, I just wanted to have kind of like different colors to show some different Also, I took some glue and I went around and then I used some sparkles on a couple of them just for a little difference, just to bring a little bling into life. I put some sparkles on this, little sparkles on yellow, but I some white, I didn't like the yellow. So after that, I cleaned out all of the sparkles and everything, and I put the stickers in. Now, if you're not using stickers, you're using um, something else, you might have to... These were kind of covered, so I didn't have to get to podge them or, or anything, but you might want to do some Mod Podge if you're using regular paper that doesn't support. I didn't have to do that. All you do is pour the resin up flush with the top of the uh, picture frame. Don't overfill it. Okay, I just have to turn this to enough. After 12 hours or so, I actually didn't touch them for 24 hours. I just like to make sure. Oh, pop the bubbles. I pop the bubbles. I didn't really have a lot of bubbles. Don't forget to congratulate yourself on how awesome your craft is. Because you're done. And here's the final result. So hopefully this brings a little bit of positivity in your life. And if it does, please hit the like button. And if you'd like to keep seeing crafts like me, hit the subscribe button. Stay positive.